What's up, curl friends and fellow product junkies? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, my name is Elena, and today we're going to be using some more new products. Um, just finished deep conditioning with a product brand that shall not be named on my channel, but um, if you want to see that deep conditioning session, I will link it right up here in the cards for you guys. Um, there's only one brand on my channel that will not be mentioned. Um, by name um, here just because of recent ex recent and past experiences that were very unpleasant so I prefer not to mention their name I uh, really don't want to give them any play but I bought the products to review to show y'all as content on my channel and so that's what I'm gonna do because I paid my coins for it so I'm just gonna share with y'all all right but anyway if you want to see that video I'll link in cards for y'all to go check out so today we're going to be using, you probably saw in the title, Nature's Little Secret. I have been wanting to use this, these products for quite a while, y'all. And don't mind this here, y'all. I got burned in the kitchen, uh, yeah, doing, cooking one of the freezer meals that I did. Are y'all enjoying those videos? How are y'all enjoying my vlogs? Like, y'all liking them? In my home decor videos? I'm trying to do something new and trying to, like, move into a different, uh, area of youtube just trying to slide into something a little bit different but still doing hair videos like i'm not gonna stop doing hair videos but let me know how y'all are enjoying my vlogs and home videos and stuff like that so anyway um yeah we're using nature's little secret today and we're using the leave-in banana leave-in and we're going to be using this irish moss styling cream that everyone has been raving about so i'm super excited to try these um products today I have been bunning for the past two weeks. Um, everyone's been doing a challenge since October started. And if y'all hear banging, I'm sorry. Husband is like running wire um, in the house. And yeah, that's what he's doing. So, um, uh, what was I saying? God, I don't even remember what I was saying. Anyway, I've been wanting to use these Nature's Little Secret products for a while. I've been seeing a lot of reviews on the... Irish Moss Styling Cream. Everyone raves about it, and I'm just really, really excited to try it today. I've been, oh, that's what I was gonna say. I've been running for two weeks. Everyone has been doing a challenge in October, and folks have been asking me, what are you gonna do, Elena? What are you gonna do for a challenge in October? My son is even doing a challenge, and so I just, I started running two weeks ago. Um, because of one of one of the one of the people that I watch here on YouTube, one of my girlfriends here, uh, has started a um, how do you say protective style challenge. And so initially I was gonna do it, and y'all know I need to go ahead and start my twist out series. But since we're doing challenges in October, everyone's doing a challenge, and everyone's asking me what kind of challenge I'm gonna do. My challenge is protective styling as well, but I'm pretty much gonna be doing bunning this month. Um, I wanted to get into twists, but I think I'll start with the twist next month, okay? So I'm just moisturizing, mining my moisturized business over here and money, okay? So that's what we're gonna do again today. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. I have been rambling enough. And I'm sorry there was no video uh, like the second week of October. Just, I told y'all what happened with my hard drive and how I had all of that footage for y'all and then it's just been busy over here it's been super super busy i'm trying to get a handle on my work schedule y'all i'm still not really situated with that i'm still kind of all over the place but it's coming along and so i just didn't get a chance to um film any hair content that week so i'm trying to get back on track with things and try to film a couple of videos you know ahead of time that empties video is coming soon um probably will be the next video after this actually um but yeah you guys just bear with me i'm still here like i said i've been over here minding my moisturized business uh so yeah all right let's start off with this leave-in y'all brand new just took the little seal off of it let's see what it smells like 
does not smell like banana. I'm not sick of these companies saying stuff is banana and it don't smell like banana. Like y'all are just fooling a sister here. It does not smell like banana at all. That's what it's looking like. Mm. It's pretty thick. It feels pretty thick. It feels like it's gonna coat the hair. It don't smell like no banana. That really bums me out because I, you know, I like to smell the products. I don't want it to just feel good. I want it to smell good too. You know, it's a whole experience. And y'all, wow, wow, that feels good. Feels good, y'all. I might have to eat my words <laughs> about that smell on this particular product because that feels really good. Boy. See how thick it is. This I feel like this is gonna be a good one for the winter because this is just coating so nicely. Oh, this feels really nice. It's like instantly coats the hair. smell hopefully the irish moss will have a, a smell to it and then you know it won't be so bummed about you know, so who has used this leave-in let me know in the comment section down below if you have tried any nature's little secret products but in particular these one that we're using today the banana leaving and the irish moss irish moss styler <laughs> let let us know how it worked for you down in the comment section below love to hear your thoughts on it Very, very nice. My hair likes this. Look at the curls just popping. Lovely. When did I buy these products, y'all? I think I bought these at um at my, what was it called? The end of the year sale from last year. Remember, I didn't really get in on Black Friday like that. And so I did get in, get in on some end of the year sales. And I think that is when I bought these Nature's Little Secret products. If I'm not mistaken, but I will leave a link above y'all can check out the haul and everything that I got when I purchased this nature's little secret products y'all this feels good I feel like I don't even need any kind of moisturizer up over on top of it that's how good it feels like it's just gonna give me moisture for days just like this maybe put an oil on top to seal it in but I feel like maybe under a gel, this would be really good. Because it's pretty thick. And it's definitely moisturizing. If I have any come next wash and go season, we'll have to try this out for sure. Or I'll probably just buy some more because I like this.
I'm gonna try to close the door because I know y'all can hear that. He's getting closer and closer to upstairs. I'll be back. All right, I'm back. So my office is downstairs and y'all will see that soon too. I have a pink office, a pink room, y'all. Y'all probably have seen glimpses of it here and there and some of my footage and also some photos that I may post on Instagram, which if you're not following me on Instagram, go ahead and do that. The link will be in the description box below where you can follow me. But I am doing a makeover in that in my office. And he's starting off pretty much by running my Ethernet wire upstairs to the modem. Because the modem is up upstairs. My office is downstairs. So he's running a wire just so nobody trips and I don't have to every day be bringing the wire downstairs so that's what he's doing he's setting it up so that it's running you know running around the doorways and things like that so that's his project for today oh I almost forgot I was supposed to let y'all know how the as I am held up right um, I think I, if you follow me on Instagram, then I did a little post, and that was like, I want to say four days um, after using it. I did have to be moisturized after the third day, but for the most part, the moisture held up. Now, when I was using it, I had like two buns as a protective style, and so like this part of my hair was starting to get dry. The rest of it was cool, but it's like up here. So every morning, well not every morning, but when I needed to like just tidy up, you know, the style, because for after sleeping it's all frizzy. So when I tidied it up, I would just, or freshen up, how do you say? Refreshen my hair, I guess you would say. I'd spray it with some aloe vera juice, and then I'd take a little bit more of the as I am and just kind of re-moisturize. And then that was it. I would brush up my hair, and then I was good to go. And I only had to do that maybe, I want to say I did it twice. I want to say I did it twice. I did it the third day, and then I think I did it maybe the fifth or the sixth day. But my hair was very, very soft the whole week. Oh my gosh, it was so soft. I can't wait to use that on twist. I saved the little bit that I had left, and I'm going to be using that for a twist out. Or just twist whenever, you know, I start doing the twist. So well, I'm sure once I use it for that next style that'll be the last of it and that jar will be empty so we'll see but yeah that was it was nice y'all i enjoyed the as i am and quite a few of you were saying in the comments you know like the leave-in is the truth and it is i always like that original leave-in um so yeah i, I feel like that leave-in did help as well uh, i also had the Jamaican black castor oil line that I really need to start digging into. I haven't quite opened it yet. I think I used the, the co-wash once, but I didn't do it on film. So, but I haven't op really opened any of that black Jama Jamaican black castor oil line yet. But I will. I will get to it. I will definitely get to it just like I'm going to get to everything in my stash. So what do y'all do as far as um, like using up your products, trying to use your products? I don't know. Everybody doesn't have fine hair like me, but my fine hair sisters out there, what do y'all do as far as you know, being able to use up your products? Um, in a how do I want to say this? How do y'all go about using up products in your stash, like getting them used up? just use like maybe one collection or something like that just until it's done or do you rotate products like what do y'all do because I decided like I said before I am going to just start like I chose a few products out of my stash and basically put them in my need to be used up pile or stash part of my stash <laughs> So I want to just concentrate on those products. I thought, you know, every wash day I'll use something different out of that particular stash. 
And then when those are used up, you know, I can move on to other collections and things like that. Uh, like I said before, I do know in between, I probably will get bored with what I chose. So here and there, I may pick up a new product to use or something like that. But for the most part, I want to use up those products that I picked out and, you know, put into my to-be-used stash. Because I'm just like, I don't like all this stuff anymore. I don't want to have all this stuff open and then it just takes me forever to use stuff up and stuff like expiration dates. used up and then there's always something new to buy so it's like I don't get rid of stuff quick enough before I'm buying more new stuff you know what I mean and I don't want to be a hoarder because it already looks like right now with my product stash like I'm a hoarder but I just need new products I just need new products so that's what it is all right, y'all, my hair feels really good with that leave-in on. Oh, my gosh, I feel like I don't need anything else on my hair right now. I could like just bun up, bun my hair right now and just go. That's how good this feels. But we are going to move on and start using the Irish Moss Styling Cream. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Little secret. Yeah, that smells nice. I can't put my finger on what it smells like, but it does smell nice. Look at these curls, y'all. Popping. <laughs> they look so good. I don't know if it was the deep conditioner or this leave-in, but my curls are definitely popping. Love the, I'm loving this wash day. This was a really good wash day. And rarely do I do wash days where I use like random products, like just different products from different brands. Rarely do I do that, but this time it was a, it was a success. It was a really good wash day. So I'm very pleased with this wash day. All right, y'all. What we looking like? Oh, this. Mm. So when you, this, this looks so nice. So when you rub it into your hands, it feels like it feels like it loosens up a little bit and becomes like more of a whipped consistency. Still on the creamy side, but I feel like it got a little lighter once I emulsified that in my hands. Let's see how it feels going on the hair. Feels dope already, like I said, with that leave-in. This is going to be moisture for days, y'all. I can tell. Yes, Lord. This is going to be really moisturizing. This would definitely make a bomb twist out. It will be moisturized crazy. I can feel this already. Definitely. For, you, for those of y'all that have like gray hair like I do, you know how sometimes you can, it feels like you can never really get your gray like really, really moisturized? This is the including grays. It's getting through the grays and it's moisturizing my gray. I can feel it. They definitely feel smoother and not as wiry as normal. 
this is some good stuff right here. This is some moisture. Feels like I got conditioner on my hair. I mean, low key is better than main choice. <laughs> uh, endless moisture, y'all. Um, yeah, and I like that endless moisture one, but this right here, this is some moisture. This is some moisture held up. Um, do I have to really moisturize after three days or does it take a little longer? I feel like three days is the average for me. Um, with any products that I use, I usually always have to be moisturized after three days. So if I can get by longer than three days, that is an exceptionally good moisturizing product for me and my hair. As y'all know, my glossy hair does not hold moisture. It don't hold nothing. <laughs> So if I can get past three days, that's a really good product. Okay. So we're gonna see. We're gonna test this out and see. I didn't put any oils on to see if I need one that I feel like I need any oils on here. This stuff is super, super moisturizing, creamy. It kind of low key feels like it has oils in it. Let me see. Yeah, there's oils in here. Yes, and the slip is there. So you, of course you have the Irish moss, you have uh, slippery elm, some flaxseed extract in here, lava soup, avocado, oil, aloe leaf juice, some kind of butter, oh, kapawasu butter, agave, nectar, there's some good stuff in here, vitamin E, yeah. Some good stuff in this cream, so I see why everybody raves about it. But like I said, I'll have this the final touch for me will be after three days. So that's what we're testing this for to see how long the moisture is going to last. But again, these two together, from what I can tell right now, moisture. Chef's kiss, chef's kiss, moisture. Okay. Let's see what it looks like when it's dry. I'll try to come back then. If not, then I'll see you back on day three. Let y'all know, or maybe day four. Let y'all know how it held up. All right, I will see y'all then. Hey, you guys. So it is day six of um, using the Irish Moss styling cream um, and protective styling. And y'all, that styling cream is good. Okay, I think I've only used it twice during the week. The first time was on, I want to say Tuesday, and then I used it again on Wednesday. But here's what I used it for. I used it more to like slick down my hair, not necessarily to re-moisturize. Um, I did re-moisturize one time, and that was yesterday, which was Thursday. Um, but it was a very light moisturizing. It wasn't like it wasn't anything crazy this stuff has really been um keeping the moisture in my hair like it feels really good my hair is really soft 
and you can definitely feel the moisture. I've been reactivating with um, aloe vera juice. And just like I said, just using a little bit of the Irish moss to kind of slick my hair down. Because I haven't been wearing a bonnet, which I know is shameful. But I have been sleeping on satin pillowcases, so not too shameful. <laughs> so yeah, but in the morning, obviously, when I wake up, my hair is like frizzy and looking crazy. So I just, you know, use the aloe vera juice, just a little bit of the um, Irish moss styling cream just to kind of slick my hair back down just like this. And I've been rocking it like this all week. Just, that's the way I've been refreshing. So, like I said, I only used it twice. So that's good stuff. I'm really, really enjoying this. I want to use this throughout the fall and winter season because, yeah, it's going to be really good. They're doing work outside, um, cutting trees down in my backyard. And I think my next door neighbor is having her grass cut. So if y'all hear that noise, that's what it all, that's what it is. But I'm in my, my pink room. And I'll be, I'll be doing a uh, remodeling of this pink room, so stay tuned for that. But I will see y'all later. Back to the video. So, what are my final thoughts on this Irish moss and the banana leave-in? A match made in heaven, y'all. This is such a good combination. Oh my gosh. If you have not tried this combination and you are looking for some moisture, you gotta try it. You've got to try it. Nature's Little Secret, they are definitely hitting the mark. Um, other reviews that I have seen as well, everybody raves about their products. Um, I have yet to try their deep conditioner, and then there's like the avocado leave-in that I want to try with the Irish moss as well. So I think that will be coming up soon. It won't be coming up next, but the next time I use the Irish moss cream, I will be using, I will try the avocado leave-in, but for this combination right here, this is bay. <laughs> this is a bay combination, and I would definitely like to do a battle between this and the main choice Endless Moisture, like just do a side-by-side -side to see which one will give me um, the longest moisture. Because this lasted pretty much all week. Like I said, I was just using um, the cream to just kind of really just slick down my hair because like I said, I wasn't using a bonnet. I was using my satin pillowcase to sleep on, but when I woke up in the morning, of course, my hair was looking crazy and it was frizzy. So when I, you know, needed to freshen, refreshen my hair, I would just use this a little bit just to kind of lay it down, reactivate it with some, um, what is it? The aloe vera juice that I'm using as well. And I only did that twice out of the week. I need to clarify this. Um, I know I kept saying I only used it twice, but in true, in truth, I used it three times in the week. So, but I only re actually re-moisturized one time in the week, and that was on Wednesday. Yeah, that was on Wednesday. The other two days, I just used a little bit of the Irish Moss Styling Cream just to kind of slick down my hair, as I stated. Um, so it wouldn't be frizzy and, you know, I'll be looking presentable during the day. So I just wanted to come in and clarify that real quick. So after that, I would just use the aloe vera juice to freshen up my hair. That's what I did today, actually. Um, I did use some edge control because as you can see, I did my edges today. But, um, yeah, I didn't have to use any more and my hair feels great, okay? It feels moisturized still, like I can feel the oils in my hair and it just feels really really good i'm gonna have to use like a clarifying shampoo to get this out that's how that's how good it is it's really really good so yeah nature's little secret is definitely going to be in the rotation this winter look for more videos on me using this twist outs braid outs etc and I think it's really good for protective styling as well because I'm using it as a moisturizer, you know, as I'm protective styling um, and not necessarily as a styler. So, yeah, I think, you know, if you want to do protective styling, try this out. Try this combination out. I'm telling you, it's going to give me moisture. It's definitely going to give me moisture. 
So you guys, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoy. Remember, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a video. And don't forget to hit the like button on your way out. It really helps my channel and helps other curl friends find me as well. So I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so, so much for watching. I love and appreciate you all. See you next time. Bye.